What truly makes us European? C'est la religion qu'on suit. C'est l'on droit où on est né. Où c'est notre désir de changer le monde. Ah. Ce n'est pas une seule chose qui est définie comme un vrai Européen. Quand même, nous restons unis. Le but de l'Union Européenne est pour la prospérité de tous ces pays. But how do they affect our lives? EU's policy affects how much farmers and fishermen can pay for their products, affecting how much we pay for them. The EU's policy ensures that sewage is dealt with properly throughout the EU countries, which means when we are on holiday in Europe, the water is safe to drink and bathe in. Air pollution is another big dilemma the EU hopes to tackle, because pollution spreads regardless of borders. The way the EU plans to tackle this is by cutting down the level of car exhaust fumes and emissions from power stations. But how exactly does this affect our generation? European rules which came into force in 2007 have imposed ceilings intended to gradually bring down the additional costs charged for calls made from or received in another EU country. As a young European citizen, the prospect of working abroad is very exciting. The Services Directive now makes it easier for us all to work abroad. The European Parliament have found a fair way to balance conflicting national interests, the right of service providers and consumers, and the needs of employees and employers. The European Parliament. For the people. By the people.